Hey Aquarius, it's the High Priestess with your general tarot reading. It's general, so if it resonates with you, leave me some comments to make sure you subscribe to the channel, okay? And tap the bell so you know when I go live and when I release the videos, okay? Okay, also check out the manifestation candles, okay? Always available on the website. Yes, very, very powerful. And if you're not following me, follow me on Instagram. Okay. I'm on Instagram and Facebook, y'all. Number four crumbs. Five of Pentacles. Aquarius, okay. Finance is shaky. Okay. Two of Cups. Two of Cups. So for some of you, I feel like is it could be like some of you, you could be just like in love with a person, head over heels in love, and like financially, like you just you under financial stress right now. Like, some of y'all, I feel like you in love and you just going through it. Some of y'all is with a person, okay? Because both of these cards got two people. You with, you in love, but y'all struggling. Like, you in a struggle of, like, relationship, okay? Like, you love a person, but I feel like they not in a position to do for you. Or it's like, I feel like they don't even really want to do. They acting. I, I feel like some of y'all with a person and a person acting like, like they can't do for you. They acting like handicapped or whatever. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like they can't do more than what they doing. I feel like, and it's just, I feel like just to spite some of you. What other messages are there for Aquarius? Okay. Follow sword and high priestess. And three of, three of Cups is here. I feel like some of y'all, I feel like some of y'all, this high priestess, I feel like some of y'all is in a relationship with a person, in a relate. And this person, I feel like they sneaky. They sneaky. And they don't want you to win. Like, truth be told, they don't want you to win. They do a lot of, like, little sneaky, shady shit. And I don't even be meaning to curse. But, yeah. Like, some of y'all with a person that's just, nah. Th three of Cups. Like, some of y'all is just, like, sleeping with the enemy. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, you know, also with the Three of Cups energy, like, some, it's like people, like, some of y'all with a person, it could be, like, more mature to you, or just know, like, some information on you, or just, I feel like they, some of y'all just with a person, and they just, like, be so happy, like, that, like, when you fail, you know what I'm saying? When you, when you fail, or when you lack, and when you don't have, and I feel like the high priestess energy, I feel like some of y'all need to trust y'all intuition because I feel like y'all feel like the shady stuff about this person, but it's like you can't really put your finger on it. Yes, you can. High priestess energy is here. Trust what your intuition is telling you. Everything you feel about this person is exactly what this person is. They spiting you, okay? Spiting you and don't want you to get ahead. What other messages? Three of Cups coming out. Queen of Swords. And I feel like y'all know this. This person trying to undermine, undermine you, but I feel like Aquarius... Y'all always, it's like, people be trying to do this to you, but you be aware of it. So it's like, I really feel like y'all need to go with what you know. And I feel like y'all need to, like, do what y'all need to do. Some of y'all need to part ways with a person. Tina Swords at the bottom. Like, y'all know, I feel like y'all trying to manipulate what you want out, out the situation. Or want what you want out the situation. But it's like... It's not even worth it. Seven of Swords. I knew this Seven of Swords was coming out, baby, because this is the energy that I'm feeling about this. Y'all need to leave this person behind, okay? Because this, it's like, it's either you going, either you leave them behind or they going to leave you behind. Because I feel like it's it's like kind of like a race. A low-key race, though. It's like a, 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 it's like, it's like a secret race. This person is in secret competition with you. Justice is here. So for some of you, it could be a Libra. I see the King of Wands is in a deck. Like, this person is just, like, be busy, busy in justice. So, I feel like with justice, it could be, uh, like, this person. You could see, like, like things happening to this person. And it's justice. It's because it's, cause it's, it's because of what the person doing to you. Like, you, I feel like some of y'all with a person, you see them, like, going through something. They may have to go to court or they may be having scrapes with the law or you could just be seeing them getting caught up in different type of stuff, okay? And that's because they doing you wrong behind your back, okay? Busy behind your back doing stuff. Judge, I see judgment in the deck. Judgment in the deck judgment is being passed that's because like judge judgment some of y'all is just going going just 
What's this card that fell? Ace of Pentacles. Like, it's time for a new beginning. And also, uh, judgment is at the bottom. Okay? Talk to the spirit. Judgment is at the bottom. Because this is what it's about. This person is receiving karma right now for the stuff they done did to you and others. Okay? So, it ain't just you. This card has different bodies. So, just karma in general is dealing with this person. Okay? This person is getting a just do. You saw the justice was here. Judgment. They being judged right now. They're getting there. They 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 going through something right now. The nine of wands, the three of wands, four of cups, the cherry, and the ten of swords. Like I really feel like for some of you, like you just went through a lot with this person. And that, with the three of wands, it's like three of wands and four of cups. It's like you still expecting the, like you still like it's like you still hoping that something come of this, baby. Ain't nothing coming of this. This is okay. Cherry and the Ten of Swords. You meant to be successful like you meant to be. Just go with what you meant to be. This Ten of Swords, this is the end in here. It's the end in here. So you, because you could see a person getting their karma served, do you see a person going through that? Judgment is coming out. Two of Wands. You need to, you need to, you, some of y'all need to take heed. Pay attention. You're being shown that for a reason. Take that information and do what you shall with the information. Meaning you're supposed to do something with that with what you're seeing. Because we're just two of wands. You don't do nothing. He just sitting there holding the world. You do something. You see this going on and you're not doing nothing. You're just standing still. Something going to happen. You either going to move or get moved. And I feel like some of y'all need to get moving. This chariot is on top of everything. Okay, it's time for some of y'all to get moving. Cancer energy. Some of y'all have been through, been through it. Okay, nine of wands and the ten of swords is here. Y'all done been through some things. Okay. What other messages are there for Aquarius? Aquarius, sun, rising, and Venus placements. Tower. I know, baby, I already knew this tower was coming. I deal, deal or be dealt with. Get down or lay down. You're going to be dealt with. You're going to be dealt with accordingly. Okay? And it's the world. So these lessons, the world is sadder and these lessons. And for some of you, you experiencing this or for some of you, you're even going through this. Some of you are going through this. Okay? Some of you could be at a point in your life where you feel like you just going through like hard times. And it's hard times to come because this, this chariot, the tower on top of the chariot, so you ain't done yet. Baby, you ain't done. Almost. The world's at the bottom. Okay? Some of y'all is completing cycles. All right? Judgment here. You're going, you elevating spiritually. So whatever the karma that you're seeing for somebody else, like, pay attention, baby. Okay? Because you're seeing it for a reason. What other messages are there for Aquarius? Aquarius, Sun, Rising, and Venus. Two of Wands, Nine of Pentacles, Six of Swords, Two of Cups, Ten of Cups. Your happiness is on the other side, baby. Some of y'all need to be alone for a while. You need to be single for a while. Get yourself together. Get your heart back. Get back to loving yourself. Start making plans, okay? I feel your money, go, things are going to change. I feel like your money going to get better. More opportunities. Okay, happiness and love is on the side when you leave. You see the six of sword? You going into happiness when you leave. After you single for a while, you going to go into happiness. And I feel like some of you, you, you might be fear of being single. You might fear that. Okay, but I feel like after you've been, you single and you've allowed yourself to, you know, let go of, Whatever you holding on from that situation or whatever, it's love and happiness on the other side for you. What's at the bottom? Death card. I already, I felt the death card energy already. It's change and transformation for you. Scorpio energy. Some of you are with a Scorpio. Okay. Scorpio, Cancer. Who else here? Okay. What other messages are there for? Aquarius. Aquarius, Sun, and Rising, and Venus. Okay. The Knight of Cups. Because the Knight of Cups. In the sun, in the eight of pentacles. Like some of y'all just need to just like work, get 
get busy working on yourself, working on goals, okay? Working on being happy. Some of you need to be working on being happy alone, okay? Leo energy here. So I feel like some of y'all have some work to do. Work, work on like being free and not being tied down and in that chaotic energy. Okay, Oracle. Okay, because it's ir irreconcilable differences. Divorce final. This is it. Some of y'all is even going through that with that justice. Okay, some of y'all is, is actually that's your situation. Like you're going through an actual divorce and it's final. Y'all can't and you can't get it back together. Because for some of you is mistresses and third parties. Okay, you've been having a hard time the entire relationship for some of you. All right. This is time to move on. It's over. Let's pull one more oracle. I don't think we need it. It's fine. Pig, beware of greed and shark. Take care or there will be a loss of material wealth. Self-explanatory. Greed, beware of greed. Some of y'all, y'all know your situation. Greed going on. Some of y'all was working hard for the, for the next person and they being sneaky behind your back. Okay? That's where the shark coming in at. So those are your messages, Aquarius. Leave me some comments. Make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next week. I know I ain't put a video out for y'all last week. My bad, y'all. I was studying for my real estate exam, and I'm proud to say I am now officially a realtor. I passed my test, okay? So y'all, leave me some congratulations in the comments if you watched the end. Thank y'all. Thanks for watching.